This is not a dream or a nightmare. Prepare yourself for deep sleep and beware of monsters that dwell within. They were a part of my dream. I felt like they came from the outside, from the depths. The nightmare didn't fade away like I thought it would. I couldn't stop thinking about it. What if it was real? I became obsessed with it. I don't know why. Maybe I just wanted to prove myself wrong. So I went to a local library to see if there were any past records of dreams similar to mine. Oh. Cold having outside. It's cold last time too. She grows poorly trained. Psychology of dogs, huh? Nothing about lucid dreaming. Nothing interesting here. He she quotes poorly translated. More books about human psyche. Psychology books. Alright, let's go into the library. Oh, it's a note. What's it say? As long as you don't know you are dreaming, you are safe. Well, that's unfortunate. No, 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 no. I'm dreaming. Are the monster's gonna try to eat me again. Not what I went for. No, it was someone called L Deck. Physics, thermodynamics. Nothing interesting here. Nothing about lucid dreaming. Nothing here. Maybe the book on the table? Boop. Huh. A dusty old book. All pages are blank. That's weird. Can I... Oh. Hey, look. Missing book. I wonder what goes in there. Boop. Oh. Wait, this was where the exit was. Hey, it's a painting from the first one. Yeah, it does. Oh, this time you find batteries before the flashlight. What's that? A piece of paper. What's it say? It exists since human race. Oh, it's pieces of a bigger puzzle, eh? Okay, okay. What's through the door? Freeze at eyeballs? Power. This is just a dark. Ah, nope, nope. Hey, I know this place. Sort of. Wait, has my has my dream always take place in like the same location? Ah! You again? Why have you returned? This place is dangerous. Who are you? You again? We met. You are a real sleeping, wait. My name is not important. I am a traveler like you. You're a real sleeping human? Yes, as crazy as it sounds, I am as real as you are. What are you doing here? Currently, I'm hiding your actions have, have, currently I'm hiding. Your actions have drawn their attention. So this is not only my dream? Dreams are like personal pockets, but only to a certain level. At this depth, it's one big world for everyone, much like reality. Can't you wake up? Maybe I can, but I just don't want to. Maybe whatever life I had out there is even worse than this. It's none of your business. Why would anyone want to be here? Well, you are here, aren't you? And had your chance to escape, yet you returned. This place lures you, and then it consumes you like a swamp. What are you doing here? Currently, I'm hiding. Your actions have drawn their attention. Can't you wake up? This depth? One big world? Think of it as a river that joins with another river. And so on, at some point, they all fall into the ocean. Are there any other travelers here? This realm is huge! You can find travelers from time to time, for example. Have you met Felicity? 
She lives in the attic. Don't go there. She's dangerous. Why is Felicity dangerous? Because she is crazy. That's why. She's been here for too long. She couldn't wake up and she just lost it. Watch out for her. How long has she been here? Years. She has lost both her mind and her humanity. How long have you been here? It's none of your business. It's not, I'm not crazy, if that's what you suggest. Who are you? My name is not important, okay. You again, have we met? Not in person, however. Last time I left you a recorded message which led you to the night lighthouse. You shouldn't have come back here. I had to know if this was real. Well, now you know, but they won't let you reach the lighthouse this time. Can you help me? No, I risked my life for you once. This time, you're on your own. Stay hidden. If they sense you, if they find you, I don't know how to wake up. Of course you don't know. People spend years preparing for this, learning, practicing. I had no idea about all of this. So you've jumped into a pool that's too deep without even checking, and you haven't learned to swim? Now leave me before they find us. I'll go away if you help me. Hmm. Since you've killed one of them, what? They will hunt you. They've probably already blocked all the ways out. This means you can only go deeper. Deeper? How? And why would I? Because they might l not look for you here. And sometimes you have to bounce off the bottom to reach the surface. And what about when I go deeper? I don't know. I have never been deeper than I am now. Hopefully you find something to bounce off. Thank you. You're welcome. Now if you don't have any more questions, please leave as promised. I've killed one of them with light. And that is exactly why you should go away. I don't want to be anywhere near when they get you. Oh, goodbye. What's in this room? Ooh, hey a flashlight. I have not found a code. Oh, what's this room? Wait, there's two rooms now? Whoa. Bert. Hey, Bert. It's kind of weird. Yeah, there's a lock, too. Creepy clown poster. And I have a key. Ooh. Oh, and another key. Can't reach that. Uh, it's dark down there. Can I find my flashlight down there? I can see the bottom. Dark down there. That's locked. That's the creepy bird clown. Let me see if my key works. Nope. The freaky monster's up there. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I don't want to go over there. Uh, the freaky monster. It's locked. Key? Hooray! Alright, as long as the rooms aren't dark, I don't think the monsters are there. A bed. A bed. A bed. A bed. A bed. And a bed. Um. Okay, back in the creepy room then. Don't want to go down the hall, but I've got a flashlight. Ah, oh. ah, rude. Scaring the crap out of me. Just a freaking head mounted on a wall. It's still death, just a different kind of death. <laughs> yeah, there's creepy little things in the room. Eight, eight, five, three. <laughs> oh, good. I got a pointer. You can point at things with it. Jesus Christ, the fuck was that? <sighs> Give me a freaking heart attack. Wrong room. No! Oh! I don't think I was supposed to do that. Oh. 
Never mind. Before I go into the freaky room at the freaky door, the last time I had that freaky monster in it, we're gonna try this door first. God, I'm gonna get lost. Piece of paper. Sir, they live, but desperately. I need to start memorizing my bath. Another piece of paper. As long as you don't know you are dreaming, you are safe. They attack detached from... Oh my god, how many pieces of paper do I need? Fountain. Interesting. Another scrap of paper. To our realm, unoccupied. I hope this flashlight has lots of battery. As long as you don't know you are dreaming, you are safe. They attack when they sense a mind attached from its body. Oh, great. Old fountain. Probably have to go back into the scary door. Actually, I should go down that path. Oh. What's this? Bag with a hole. A pile of flour. A pile of rotten bags. I need to find a way to open it. Okay. Well, as soon as I can patch this hole, I can get out that way. Please, no scary monsters. Hmm. I don't like when it just goes really far and it's like a running sequence. Oh, it's a. Just a creepy old well. Ooh, I'll put the stones in the bag. As soon as I figure out some other stuff. Yes, creepy Burt poster. Um. All right, where was the, no, yeah, yep, that's the scary room with the deer that's not a mom, oh my god, that was so freaking annoying. No, it wasn't annoying, it was terrifying. Scary. Eight, eight, five, three. Oh. Downstairs. I just remember where everything is. Yeah, we remember what happened last time.
Oh. What? Needle. Ooh. Phone, the line is dead. What is this? Oh, nope, that's my exit. Oh, so I came down. Okay, I get it. Old toys. Okay, thank you. Creepy. Oh, oh my plushie. Aw, his little tiger. That's so fair. In the first game, it was like, Cody meets his tiger. That's sad. I really see my reflection. Nope. Wait, can I use a needle or do I need thread too? Probably need thread. Old toys. What's wrong with the receiver off the hook? Or the headset? I'm not seeing anything else here. But how do I get Cody as Tiger if he's not... Hmm. Oh, what's that? Phenomenon. It would seem they have existed since the dawn of the human race. So like, not all the hominids, just the humans, just the homo sapiens. Yeah, I know, but I don't, I don't want there to be like creepy monsters in there or anything. Or am I just... I'm waiting for the monsters to show up and the shoot other shoe to drop. Alright, so now that crank that won't budge. But every time I go back to a place gonna deal with monster mayhem. Oh my god, flashlight. happens because it's happening elsewhere. Man, they seem to be not liking the, the daylight too good, so that's good. That's a, that's a good sign. I'm... How do I get here? Uh, creepy composter? Since the dawn of many race, night folk blank, they live in the realm of dreams, but desperately blank to our realm. Sounds like they're trying to kill us so they can possess us. <laughs> Damn birds. Plushy tiger probably blobs to Cody. Poor Cody. He never got his tiger. Oh, went too far. The rocks. Mm-hmm. 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 Alright, that was to see that I pointed to knock the key over. That's just a tiger. Open the thing with that, and bag of weight with that. 
Put the heavy bag in the thing. Wait, no, nope. put the heavy bag. It's not heavy enough. Oh, that mound of dirt. Uh, five kilograms is a lot more than I thought it was. A full bag. Okay. Let's see where this is. I haven't seen any monsters in a while, so I'm a little unsettling. Although I haven't seen any actual monsters. What I thought was a monster was the first time. It was actually just a head. Oh, I gotta do this one too. Oh, is this like a series of pipes that you have to open? Which one's Cody? Timmy? Cody! Okay. That was a Cody's bed. This is a strange room. Back to the library, nothing in here. Hmm. Okay, eight, eight, five, three, yeah, that got me into the room. Another piece of paper, Ooh, it's filling up. As long as you don't know you are dreaming, you are safe. They attack when they sense a mind detached from its body, which sometimes happens during comas. Oh, okay. Don't go in a coma. Oh, I guess I should have. Uh, okay. Wait, what was that? No? Okay. Creepy. Oh. Nice hiding spot. Lucid dreaming. Um. Am I missing something in the toy room? An umbrella. Poke it. Pop it. Twist it. Turn it. Hmm. Oh, 
the line is dead. An old sewing machine, eh? Okay, I'm... One of those situations where I don't know exactly what to do. Oh, scrap of paper! I first encountered this phenomenon in the early 80s, but it would seem they have existed since the dawn of the human race. Probably one, two, three, four, four, probably four or five more pieces of paper to get. And then we'll know the mystery of the mystery creatures. Takes me to the main room. That take that's underneath. I am missing something. B E R T. Bert. bunch of stuff. As long as you don't know you're dreaming, you are safe. They attack when they sense a mind detached from its body, which sometimes happens during comas, but much more often during... Oops. During oops? What the heck is an oob? Valve is already open. There's two valves open. Okay. Am I missing something here? Like, I got the valve, two valves open. Is there a third one I don't know about? I don't have any keys or anything. Are these? I'm gonna try it on all of these. Well, that did nothing. Looks like the path comes back around somewhere. An old looking town. Am I doing wrong? There's nothing here. Uh, no. Room two. It's this thing. Oh my gosh. It's a puzzle, so those three and those three. So. Those two and that one. Those three and
That means there's power now. Eh. I'd really like my wrench back, please. Go deeper. This is a working elevator. Oh, okay. Let's go to, um, let's go up. That floor. Let's go to two. Before I go deeper. Unless this just like spells my doom and I die. Nothing? Wait, this room looks familiar. Is this another previous game? I think so. Uh oh, I'm trepid. Okay. Wait, why does that pull me back? Like, trapped, trapped, or just like, trapped, find your way out. Oops. Oh, 13 to 15. Ah, oh god. Oh god. What? Why did I drop it? Oh. Cool. Go deeper though. Oh, the well. Whoa, what happened to the poster? It's all gross. Okay, let's just. There as quickly as possible. No more freaky monsters, please. Oh, wait. No more freaky monsters, please. <laughs> Alright, let's. Climb down the well, because that's where you want to go, deep into the depths of the darkness, where the monsters lurk. Nope! Come on. To be continued. Uh, 
A young boy wakes up from a three-month coma. A nine-year-old boy from a local orphanage who has been in a coma since February woke up yesterday in good health. Doctors previously didn't give him much chance of ever regaining consciousness. Boy's first words after opening eyes were, My tiger has found me! Oh, that's nice. See you at the final depth. Oh, okay. Oh, I only found 13 of 15 notes. I didn't find all the notes! Alright, so if you want me to go back and find all the notes, let me know, and we'll uncover the entire mystery of the papers. Uh, otherwise, we're gonna go to the deepest sleep. The final chapter of the Deep Sleep Trilogy. Thank you for watching this episode of the game. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe so you know when the next installment of the Deep Sleep Trilogy is posted. And now, sleep. 